Hey, I'm Fred from Optimizer. In this video today, I want to let you in on a little secret. And that secret is how you can do geo bid adjustments when you're doing smart bidding on Google. Now, as many of you probably already know, bid adjustments generally don't work if you're using automated bidding from Google. Because the whole point of automating bidding by Google is that they look at different performance by device type, different performance from different regions, different performance by day parts. So you don't have to set day parts. You don't have to set geo bit adjustments. And you still do geo exclusions, but you wouldn't say that, hey, I'm gonna bid twice as much in Florida versus California because I think my conversion rate is gonna be twice as high. Google sees that conversion rate, right? So they're already making that bid adjustment for you. But now you might say, I, I kind of still wish that I had more control and I wish that I could do these bid adjustments that I, I used to be able to do. There is actually a way and I'm going to show you how. So the first thing to look at is why would you potentially want to do geo bid adjustments? Um, so this is in our optimizer tool. This is one of our insights. It's, it's a really old insight. It's the geo heat map, um, but it's still very useful. So We've updated this tool in that you can say, I, I want to look at not just all my campaigns, but I want to look at campaigns by bid strategy. So here I'm going to say, show me all of my campaigns that are running on maximized conversion value strategies. And I'm going to update that. Okay, so now Google's uh, fetching or Optimizer is fetching this data from Google. And we've shown a bunch of locations here. And we see there's a column for cost per conversion. And this is kind of fascinating, right? Because we see that in California, our cost per conversion is about $9. In Texas, about seven, almost $8. But in Florida, it's $115 per conversion. Now, granted, this is based off of a single conversion, uh, but still, I mean, it's a pretty high number, right? And then here in uh, New York, it's $50 per conversion off of two conversions. So that maybe tells me that the geo bid adjustments Google is doing may not exactly be the most solid. Um, there might still be some efficiency we can get out of the system by making our own adjustments. Now, again, the problem is you're doing automated bidding. So if you go into Google and you set a geo bid adjustment, they're just gonna ignore it. So you can't do anything. However, there's a new tool, it's called Value Rules. And Optimizer just launched a solution for this. So you'll find it under Optimizations for Automated Bidding. It's called Optimize Value Rules. And now what this tool does is it shows you the different locations, or you can also do this for device types or, or audiences. And you can set a value rule that says, every time a conversion happens that has this attribute associated with it, so in this case, the attribute is the location the conversion came from. So say a conversion came from Austin, I want to value that conversion at 1.05 times my typical conversion value. So, so simple example, if my, Conversions, if I'm doing lead gen and I'm saying every conversion that I get, every lead form that's filled is worth $100. Well, in this case, what Google would say is, oh, if we see that conversion, but it came from Austin, it's now worth $105 instead of $100. Uh, likewise, if it came from Berlin, where we have a 1.03 value rule, that conversion of $100 now becomes worth $103. Now back up for a second. Think about Google's bidding system. Google's bidding system is basically just looking at what is the probability of a conversion and what is the probability of value from a click. Um, that doesn't really change. The probability of the conversion happening doesn't change based on what you've put into this tool from Optimizer. But what does happen is the value, right? So now if Google says, well, instead of expecting $100 of value from this click that came from Austin, we will actually see $105 of value. So they can incrementally, by 5%, increase your bid and still hit the same return on ad spend that you previously had. So in effect, what this is doing is it's exactly like a geo bid adjustment. And so what's really cool is that this isn't the way the tool was intended to be used, but you can use it that way. So that's the tip, that's the secret, that's how you can do geo bid adjustments for your smart bidding campaigns.